Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Get Fit With Jess and welcome to day one in our Hello Arms Challenge. I'm so excited that you are joining this challenge with me. I know that we're gonna get stronger this week. We're gonna feel more confident uh, as we're moving into summer and wearing those tank tops and just feeling good about ourselves, feeling good about our strength. Again, I'm really excited that you're here with me. If you didn't read the caption uh, in my post today, either on Instagram Instagram or Facebook, make sure that you check that out. I'm also sharing that information right here on YouTube in the comments. So check that out. I'm going over all the details of this challenge, how it works, what to expect, all the things. We will talk a little bit as we're working out today about those things too, but I wanted to make sure that you are in the know, you know what's going on this week. So let's talk about today's workout. Today we are going to focus on biceps and triceps. So that takes up a big part of the arm. So we're going to hit that today. I do have a bench out. I'm going to be doing a seated concentrated curl. Okay. You could also do that standing. You could also do that kneeling. So if you're going to go down to the floor, I would suggest getting a mat or maybe put a towel or a, a pillow or something underneath your knee. We will be laying down for one exercise to hit the back of the arm, those triceps. Again, that could be done uh, on a bench. That could be done down on the floor, on your bed, wherever you want to do that. So that's what I have out. I do have out my dumbbells. I have a heavier and a lighter set. Just grab what you have and let's get right into this. So we're going to warm up together. Just start by swinging and swaying your arms with me. Good. So again, I'm so excited that you're here for this challenge. We're gonna break it up each day into a couple of different uh, muscle groups. So like I said, today we are focusing on the biceps and triceps. Let's go ahead and take a deep breath in, arms up, palms to touch. We're gonna drop down and extend up. So this is an overhead tricep extension. We're just using this as a stretch here, but in just a few minutes, we are going to add either one or two dumbbells to this move. Good, two more right here. One more, good. Now pull your right arm down, stretching through the wrist, the forearm, and then up into that bicep. Good, all right, and switch, other side. So like I told you, the muscles that we're working today, we're gonna superset that, which means we're gonna uh, do a bicep move and then we'll pair that, superset that with a tricep move. And we'll go back and forth, 30 seconds on, 15 seconds off, just take one ear to your shoulder, and then we'll do, or sorry, that's the wrong timing. 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off today, and we'll do three rounds through. Good. We have three different groups that we're gonna do today, and then a little finisher at the end. I think that you're gonna love this workout, you're gonna love this challenge, and then like I said, I know we're gonna Leave this week feeling stronger and better than ever. Let's take our arms, push back, open up that chest. Good, reach forward. Good, let's do a couple of deep breaths right here and then we're gonna get right into this. Good, one more. Big reach on this one. Good, all right, so our first move is called a hammer curl that's gonna target the biceps. So palms are gonna face each other, we're gonna curl up, so it's almost like you're bringing your thumbs up towards your shoulders, okay? We could alternate this right, left, or do both arms together. I'm gonna leave that up to you. I'm gonna try to start mine doing them together, but then if I need to drop back a little bit, if it gets too challenging, then uh, we can always alternate that out. Are you ready? Get set, let's go. Hitting those biceps. So I want to talk to you about the muscles that we're working because I really want us to get that mind-muscle connection and get the most out of this workout, get the most out of this challenge this week. Good. Um, so uh, if you read, hopefully you did read the caption. I'm going to be giving away a free either basic training boot camp session. That's my signature four week program. Let's do one more right here. Good. Um, and or a free month in my Fit Life monthly membership. So that could be either $55 value or a $40 value, just kind of depending on which program. All right, let's do those overhead tricep extensions, one or two weights. Get ready. 
Get set, let's practice it and go. So this first round through is our practice, learning the moves, and then in rounds two and three, we're gonna own it, we're gonna give it our best. Maybe we're gonna go heavier. If you need to go heavier, good. Keep those elbows in right by your ears, press up. Think about flexing your arms at the top. Yeah, there you go. So let's talk about how you can win that either basic training or free month in my monthly membership. You're gonna participate in these workouts. You're gonna do every workout with me this week. We'll have five. Good, one more right here. Okay, how did that feel to you? Again, if you can go up, go up if you're good right here let's stay right here i think i'm good for round two i might push up in round three we'll see how i feel okay 10 seconds and we're gonna do those again like i said two or three rounds total so two more to go ready here we go so to win that prize you need to do each workout with me this week um, i need you to like those i need you to save them come back to those anytime all right uh, these are perfect to take with you quick workouts you can do anywhere with very minimal equipment right we're just using some dumbbells here um, i need you to share those so share those out on social media either to your feed your stories or both all right uh, you can also tag some friends in the comments uh, to do these workouts and do the challenge with us this week that's time good overhead tricep extension by the way were you feeling it in the bicep feeling a little burn there i was definitely i'm gonna go up this round for my overhead extensions and i'm gonna glue two weights together here all right ready set let's go it's really important that we keep those elbows in so watch this we don't want it to look like this Okay, so tuck your elbows in. It's like you're trying to keep your ears warm with your biceps. There you go. Also, you don't wanna be pushing your butt back like this. So tuck the hips under. Yeah, you got it. Form is everything. So I want you to think good quality reps here. Awesome. 10 seconds. That is time. Okay, we got one more round of these two moves. What can you do? I think I'm good right here. I'm definitely uh, feeling towards those last couple of reps. I'm, I'm struggling, okay? It's getting challenging and that's what we want. That's how we get those muscles, get that tone and definition that we want. Ready? Let's go. So you gotta make sure you're challenging yourself, whatever that looks like for you. And that's gonna look different from person to person. But just make sure, like I said, those last couple of reps, you're really having to give, give your all to get them up there. Good. Breathe through it. You're doing great. 15 more seconds and these are done. Woo. Eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, let's do one more. Ah, there you go, good. All right, we're moving in to our last set of these triceps. And then we're gonna do two different moves in the next group. So each of these workouts are gonna pretty much be around 20 minutes or so, just to kind of give you a guide about that, give you a little heads up. Let's go. You have 20 minutes for yourself. I know life is busy, crazy, chaotic sometimes, it is hard to make time for us because usually we're run, run, running, doing for everyone else. But I want you to show up for you this week. Show yourself that you are worth it, you deserve it. Listen, we are better when we can you know, give to others, better when we give just a little bit of time to ourselves. So I want you to remind yourself of that this week. I'll for sure be right here beside of you reminding you that's time. Okay, how did that feel to you? Hopefully that felt good. Like I said, we are moving on. Um, we're gonna do kind of a, a little bit of a concentrated movement now. So in our left hand, we're gonna hold a weight 
and in our right hand, we're gonna curl. So you're, you're holding about halfway, okay? And then, so we'll do that for 20 seconds, and then I'll tell us to switch. We'll hold that right arm, curl the left. And then same kind of concept going into the tricep move. We're gonna come into um, a hinge position, elbows are up. We're gonna hold one arm, and then we're gonna kick back the other. 20 seconds, and switch. All right, let's practice it. Get ready. Hold that left arm, curl the right for 20 seconds. Let's go. Good. Trying not to grip the weights too tight here. Awesome. I'll tell you when to switch. We got about five more seconds. Good. And switch. Go. Hold that right, curl the left now. My uh, arms are talking, hello arms, right? We'll be saying that all week long, hello arms. Three, two, one, good. Now, it's important on these tricep kickbacks that we relax the shoulders, so I do, uh, don't want us to shrug, and that's, that happens just naturally when the, the movement gets challenging, but try to keep the, the shoulders down, elbows pinned in. All right, let's hold our right arm, or no, sorry, yes. Kick back to your right arm, hold the left, okay. So right arm first here. And notice how I just kind of took my gaze from looking up at you to looking down just a few feet in front of me. That's gonna keep my spine neutral so I'm not straining looking up the whole time, okay? I mean, obviously watch me for form. Go ahead and switch. But once you got the move, then just get into the zone, get focused. Good, get that pinky up nice and high, three, two, one. Okay, that was practice. How'd it feel to you? Let's do it again. Change up your weights or stay right where you are. I think I'm good, right where I'm at. All right, and feel free to drop your weights. I know we're holding weights quite a bit here. Feel free to drop the weights, kind of shake out the wrists. Let's go, round two. Hold and curl. Very good. So palms are facing up now. Good, and switch. We're going all the way down, all the way up. You got it. I'm feeling some heat, feeling some burn happening in those biceps. What about you? Five, four, three, two, one more. Good, all right, let's get ready for these triceps. Tricep kickbacks. What I was saying there is we wanna think about getting our pinkies up nice and high towards the sky. Get that full flex, full extension in the tricep. We go in five seconds. Get ready. And let's go. Hold and kick back. Good, good. Five seconds and we're switching. And go, other side, kick it back. Good, good. Five, four, three, two, one, rest. Okay, one more set of those and then we have one more group to go, okay? That last group's gonna look a little different since like I said, we're doing some concentrated moves there. All right, get ready. Stand up nice and tall and straight. Deep breath, hold and curl. Let's go. Last time, best time. You're doing great. 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch right into it. Let's go.
Very nice. Eight, seven, six. Come on, don't give up here. Finish these. One more. Woo, good, 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 good. All right, shake it out, breathe. Let's get ready for these kickbacks. And then we'll either take it to the floor or to our bench. Get ready, get set, let's go. I started with the other arm, it doesn't matter. <laughs> we gotta do them both, don't we? Very nice. Get ready to switch. One more and go. Other side. Come on, press it back. Squeeze those triceps. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good. All right, so like I said, we're changing some things up in this last group. We're doing 30 seconds on, 15 seconds off. That's why I got confused there at the beginning. I knew that we were doing that timing at some point. Okay, so we're gonna go concentrated curl on the right, 30 seconds, rest. Back into it one more time. Then we're gonna lay down and do our right arm uh, tricep extension. So one arm tricep extension, and then we'll do all that to the left and we're done, all right? So get ready. Like I said, you could do this down here in a kneeling position if you don't wanna have a seat. Ready, let's go. Right arm, concentrated curl. So we got that elbow pinned in, all the way down, all the way up, good. Come on, squeeze. We've got good control, all the way up, all the way down. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, how'd it feel to you? I think I can go a little heavier, so I'm gonna bump mine up. If you can do the same, go for it, but if you were good with where you were, stay right there for one more set. Get ready. Let's go. Exhale up, inhale down. Whoo, hello bicep. 10 more seconds. Oh. Good, good, good. One more. Awesome. Okay, so pretend I'm laying down right here. I'm gonna extend my right arm straight out in front of me, okay, right over the chest. I'm gonna support with my left arm here. I'm gonna drop down and then extend up. All right, so let's lay back, right arm, ready, set, let's go. So either on the floor or on a bench or on your bed, just a one arm tricep extension. Good. Great work. Five, four, three, two, one, rest. How did that weight feel to you? We got one more set, and then we're gonna finish up with the left arm. We are so close to being done. Hang in here with me. Ready, get set, let's go. Good, good. Come on. You got this. We got this. Oh no, I feel it too. Push and power through for five, four, three, two, one. Good, all right. Bring that up, roll that up. Let's get ready for that concentrated bicep curl over here, left arm. Get set and go right into it. Remember, all the way down, all the way up, and slow and controlled. Five, four, three, two, one, good, shake it out. 
Get ready, just one more set, give it your best. And as we're kind of finishing up these last couple of moves, I wanna to talk to you about something very important, and that is your nutrition. Ready? Let's go, let's talk while we do this. So, to get the results that we want, to get that tone, that definition, to get those muscles stronger so we can see them more, we've got to fuel our bodies well. So we put a huge emphasis on protein in my programs. Uh, most of us are very much under eating in protein. So I kind of always just see where my clients are starting out. Let's do one more. Good. All right, let's lay back and continue to talk. So I always like to see where my clients are starting out. We create that nutritional awareness and then we try to build and make progress with that. Let's go, tricep extension. I teach my clients how uh, to log and track their food. Uh, we will customize their macros to their needs, their goals, because again, yeah, that's gonna be different from person to person. So we definitely do, uh, talk a lot about nutrition because these two go hand in hand. We gotta have them both to get those results that we want. And I wanna help you get those results. So let's start to think about that this week. Please ask me any questions that you have. One more. I want to help guide you and help you the best that I can this week. Like I said, I want this week for us to finish feeling strong and confident and energized. We got to have nutrition to do that. All right, one more set and we are done. Ready? Let's go. Down and up. Good. And just one more thing about that nutrition. We don't have to do anything extreme. We don't have to do anything crazy. We just have to get back to the basics in fueling our bodies well, doing that consistent, consistently and finding balance. That's what I help my clients do. That is my mission. That is my goal. Three, two, one. Woo! All right. Take your time. Maybe you want to stay down. Maybe you want to come up. I would highly encourage you to do some light stretching just for a minute or two uh, as we are wrapping this up. I uh, hope that you enjoyed this. Please let me know in the comments. That's, again, how you are going to participate in this challenge and be able to be entered in to win that giveaway. So comment. Let me know when you get it done. Save it. Share it. Uh, stay connected all week. Tomorrow I'll be coming back. Uh, for day two with a chest and back focus workout. I'll see you there. Great job. See you soon. Bye.